Well, finally, a hiatus in the frenzy that has been this afternoon, and Tingana is now just sitting and waiting for Tundi to come back. Tundi quickly ran off, and we didn't, weren't able to find her again, so he's now just sitting, I think, waiting and hoping that she finds him again. It's quite interesting, because he marches away from her and growls at her, but then when she runs away, he decides to lie down again. Now, I just need to guide a vehicle in, because otherwise I don't think they're going to find us, so I'm waiting to hear them, and once I hear them, I'll be able to call them. But Senzo says he'll be able to watch out and let me know when he does see them. But you can see Tingana's now perfectly blended in, and it's quite a miracle, actually, that we found him. If it wasn't for Senzo being able to see him just now, moving in this direction, I don't think we would have come back and been able to see him again. So it's good that he lay down for us, at least. But you can see he's just listening now, and I'm, like I say, I'm pretty sure Tundi will be back. If she didn't kill that diker, she most certainly will be back. And if she had killed the diker, we would have definitely heard it. A diker does make a little bit of a noise when it gets killed, and we didn't hear anything and heard a couple birds alarm calling. So it's definitely that she didn't kill. I'm sure she's trying to come. Uh, yours, you can just keep coming north. I can hear you just south of me. Just keep coming north. So, like I say, just trying to get somebody else into the sighting. They, it's difficult to, to explain to them exactly where we are because of the dense, thick area. But he should be able to see me from from the road. Ah, and apparently Tundi is behind us now, walking straight towards us as well, which is fantastic news. So, they should join up quickly now, and hopefully they're going to go towards twin dams but it's going to be very thick in here here comes Tandi she's panting a little bit unfortunately because I'm sure she's exerted a bit of energy trying to chase that diker away right here we go since are you ready okay because this is gonna be a rough one through here but I know a little shortcut through a certain area oh that was a bit of a bump there Now let's see, I wonder, can I get over this? Let's try. Come on Wendy, come on. There we go. There we go, we got through there, well done. Okay. Right, Senzo, you're our spotter to keep us. Uh, here she is. Look how she's got her nose down. She's busy trying to sniff where he's gone. Look, now she's trotting. Shame, girl. Are you trying to find him again? I must be honest. I do like when leopards run like that. It's almost like they got this little bounce, like they from sort of Tigger days, um, Winnie the Pooh. That's how I always think of them. But she, oh, she can move quickly. Now I'm very glad that I've done a few bushwalks in this area because I roughly know where we're going to have to go to keep up with them. It's not going to be easy, but we certainly will try. Um, of course, it's much easier on foot to negotiate this than it is... I can see her just on my right. Oh, Wendy, you're such a champion. So Wendy's being an absolute delight. She's going like a dream. Which I can see him and they're going to come out into this clearing right here and this pathway that we're on now takes us to a little clearing and then we'll drop down into the Mulawati towards Twin Dams which is fantastic so there we go there's Tandi in front and Tum Tingana is just to our right this Tingana Tumba story is going to be the, the death of me I think I, I can't I keep getting them tongue-tied. They both start with T's, and it's certainly not easy to remember who's who. And just because we always go Tandi Tumba, if, uh, yes, Alice, just like Tara and Taylor, you see, it's all T's. You would think I would be good at T's, given my name starts with a T, but, well, it seems as though I've just got no chance. Maybe it's because I'm just too excited about today. I don't know. Could be that, too. It smells like popcorn, everybody. It's a very strong scent of popcorn. Obviously, Tingana has just given a little deposit here. Um, Senzo, are you ready for the really thick stuff? Okay, good. 
Okay, here we go. Actually, it's not too bad. I remember now where we are. We're not too bad. They're gonna go through a little tumbleweedy thicket, and then it should actually be all right. They've been very kind to us because if they had gone to the right, we would have had a problem. But they've luckily stayed on a pathway that allows us to be able to follow them, which is fantastic. I see Tangana, he's down in the Mulawati already. So I'm gonna try and find a way just to get down to where they are. Tandi will sh probably shortly join him. So while I try and negotiate my way down to the Mulawati, let's go back to Tara and the Lioness, who's making a way to Gari Dam, which is great news because remember, the buffalo were there earlier.